Hey, there we go. <laughs> so how does it feel entering this universe of the Beavis and Buttheads this, for this time around? Uh, it's great. I mean, they're lucky that the universe came back for them, you know? It doesn't happen. You get a second life as a universe. But, yeah, it's uh, it's amazing. I mean, and like I said, it's like any Mike Judge thing, I would, I would do. He's like Coen Brothers kind of like dream to work with thing so so how were you brought on on this project and who are you playing i i play richard whack and i'm not sure if i play some other ones we i recorded a bunch of voices and they were like changing stuff around um depending on who who the other actors were um but yeah i play this like uh, oh i also play a guy in the at the mall that's it <laughs> i record a bunch of them um so yeah, and I can't. I th- I either got the job thanks to Lou Mor- Morton, who used to write on Veep, um, in combination with Julia Ashton, who's an amazing, you know, casting director, and she's benefited me and put me in so much stuff. I love her. So now, you you you've done a lot of animation series and movies, and re- most recently, Bob, Big Bob, Bob's Burgers, Burgers and and so on. What what makes this project different from all the other ones? Uh, well, it's a Beavis and Butthead movie. There weren't. I mean, it's, that's obvious. That's, that's basically the answer to your question. <laughs> uh, no, but it, I mean, I would say <laughs> during. I also recorded in my basement for Bob's Burgers, so they're very similar in that regard. Um, but this one is just a totally different. It's just a different world, you know. It is like this extreme crass, but very smart um, world. And Bob's Burgers has is, is, is become like a sweet but still a little uh, got a little edge to it so I guess they're the inversion of each other mm-hmm. inversion of each other's worlds and before I let you go wh- wh- why do you love animation so much or at least this this type of job two two answers one uh, they employ me so I think the animation industry is wonderful and I support it as an art um, and then the other thing is it, it reminds me a little bit of like improv in that the the limitations of what the world can be is only within the artists, you know, or the people they hire to illustrate it. So, uh, from that respect, I, I, I love that. It. It's just like it, it can be a very mind driven, but not budget heavy. This is a terrible answer. <laughs> Industry. Anyway, employ me. Thank you. Well, thank you for speaking with us. Thanks.